Hi, welcome to Simply Simple Life. Today I am going to harvest some greens. This green is called Punangani Kirai in Tamil. I will also be replanting this green. I had posted a video earlier showing how you can compost in a flower pot as well as plant something in it. Uh, this is the pot I used and this is the lovely green that I planted. I have already harvested from it once. I have also posted a video for the harvesting. I will leave the links for both the videos in the description box below. I am going to cut and replant them because many stems have grown so long that they are not able to stand tall anymore. I will replant them again in this pot as well as another pot because I think uh, I will have many stems to plant. They look very nice, lovely, isn't it? And you can see that there are some dead leaves and uh, dead stems. What we can do is we can uh, put them back again in the soil so that they will become good fertilizer for the plant. So first I will harvest this green. So this is my harvest. It doesn't seem like much, it's just one one bunch, a handful of greens that I've got but I'll be cooking it along with some other greens that I have at home. And you can see that I have left a lot of leaves on uh, most of the stems, you know. That's because I'll be cutting and uh, planting them again and this will give them a really good head start because they have leaves they can quickly start uh, making their food and you know uh, putting down their roots and all those things they will be able to do that if they have some leaves left uh, I'm just taking one empty pot you can see that the holes in these are quite big so if I directly put soil in this and start watering the plant it will lose out a lot of soil so that's the reason I put in a cloth it's a cotton cloth it's an old cloth that I uh, had so I'll just put one layer of this cloth at the bottom and on this now I'll start putting the soil and some vegetable waste that I have from today's uh, cooking and I will also add some coconut the husk kind of thing that comes um, on the coconut I use coconuts a lot in my cooking so this is a, um, a regular uh, waste that comes out of my kitchen so I usually use this first I'm adding a small layer of soil with the potting mix that I have there is just one tiny layer So I'm going to be adding this also, all these dry, dried leaves and dead plant material, everything can just go in. I'm adding some coconut husk on this. So I've added in the organic waste and uh, I've added in the coconut husk also. Uh, it's almost half or more than half filled. If I press it down, it's about half filled. So on top, I will be putting in the uh, soil. You can use any soil, any potting mix or compost. If you have compost, you can use that. I don't have any at the moment. So I'm just putting in the potting mix. The pot is ready so now we can start cutting and planting these greens. So to cut we have to 
cut at these joints this is where it will let out roots very easily So can you see that I have cut out so much out of it and I've only left those which are straight and tall and all those that were bent and the stem wasn't strong enough to hold straight I have cut them and I will be planting them again and for few you can see that I have cut it out completely and there are no leaves left I want to see if they will actually develop any leaves later on so that's just going to be an experiment here i'm going to be filling it up with a little more of uh, soil potting mix in this and now that i have this much of uh, new stems I want to find another pot in which I can plant these also. So here I have three pots ready and the final step is just water them. 